Hey, I'm Nick Boy, and welcome to Pocket. Today I'm checking out Punch Club by Lazy Bear Games. Now, this game was supposed to be released later in the month, but Lazy Bear did say that if players could beat the game using Twitch, then they would release it early. Well, I think we've learnt by now, never bet against Twitch. 70,000 players beat it, now we can play it. So I'm gonna take a look. All I need is 69,999 other people to help me beat it. And seriously, I've been listening to this music for like five minutes. It's still great. Oh, there's a little, there's a little man riding on top of the bridge. That doesn't look safe. What the hell is that? Okay, okay, stop getting distracted. Punch people. Someday you'll be better than me. Who's he talking to? Your potential is, who are you talking to? Take care of your amulets. They will help you uncover your abilities. Your mum is calling, don't make a wait. Oh, I don't think those kids are listening. Shadow. I know you'll never listen to me. Death is the only choice you have. Wow, this everything about this game is so fast. I'm already dead. The main character is already dead. Don't cry. I'm only dead. You have to be stronger than me. Promise me you will train hard. That's one of those stories. This is Batman or Spider-Man or Daredevil. So kid, you're alone now, just like me. Wow, thanks police officer. We just burnt through about 30 minutes worth of story. You know, any new origin story for Marvel superheroes could really take a lesson or two from that. Shit, what? Okay, Frank, I'll do it. I've left a newspaper on the table. There should be some job offers. See ya. Okay. No thinking about jobs. I need to work out and have breakfast. I should do some push-ups. Yes, I should. Done? That was it? I did my push-ups. There should be some food in the fridge. Soda? Sweet and tasty but not healthy. Frozen pizza, like normal pizza but frozen. Neither of those things are healthy. Uh, but we're gonna start the day with a healthy frozen pizza. Unthawed. Okay, I'm ready to find a job. Let's look at the newspaper. Why is the guy always dressed like a boxer? Why did he sleep in boxing shoes? Work. Spend time and health to earn money. What? What? City map. Did I just get a job? Did I just get a job by looking at the paper? It's easy as that. It really, it's really not. I mean, to get this job, I had to know someone. That was about it. Travel. Travel to work. By bus, by foot. Three hours, six dollars. Ooh, interesting. How many, how many dollars do I have? Uh, I got 35 bucks. Uh, I'm gonna do it by time because I got oodles of it. Holy shit, what is happening? I feel like all the bits of the game that are like so much is cut out of the middle. Try to catch me, run away. No way, start a fight. Sure, take my shoes too. I'm not a coward. I'm gonna run away. No, I'm gonna start a fight. You have to choose skills that your character will be using during the fight round. Fill all empty slots. Skills are divided into different tabs, offensive, defensive. Right, that was the little paper clip from Microsoft. Uh, kick, that seems like a active skill. And, oh, he's got a couple of things. He's got a high punch and a hit bat. Defensive, dodge. Gives you a chance to evade enemies for no damage. Okay, cool, and that's it. Let's do it. Yeah, just keep kicking. Now go into defensive mode. No, just keep kicking. Now go into defensive mode. Do I need to do anything? Kick, kick. Oh no, I'm so nearly about to die. Kick, kick. was like the first fight I was actually in. Um, what did I do wrong? And maybe I'm supposed to click it when it flashes? You finished your first fight, now you feel strange. I saw you fight, that was pretty impressive. Was it? Were you actually watching me? Do you think I'm the guy with the bat? <laughs> uh, I've always had a pretty great right hook. Incorrect. They used to call me legs at school. I may look skinny, but I'm quick. Uh, sh let's say legs. Hey, you have really strong legs. <laughs> this old guy wants to date me. Um, new perk, strong legs. You've never used an elevator, so your legs are really strong. <laughs> Freshen yourself up and come to my office. Then we'll have a talk. Sure, where's your office? I assume I'll just teleport immediately there. You need to visit Mick's office. I'm gonna take the bus so that no one hits me with a bat. You've met Mick, he knows a lot about fighting. You 
you feel a connection between the two of you. Oh, wow. That's an Indiana Jones outfit. It's a Ninja Turtle! He trained the Ninja... Splinter?! I told you before that you have potential. I can make you a champion. It's a long road. You have to take the first step yourself. There's an amateur fight league in my friend's gym. If you can prove your worth, I will train you. Go to Silver's gym. You can work out there if you're tired of doing it at home. Meet Silver at Silver's gym. If you're short on money, come to me and I'll feed you. Mick. A lot of this is just going to different places for incredibly brief conversations in incredibly detailed backgrounds. Hi, Mick says I can train in your gym. Big Mick! I thought he didn't care about boxing no more. He says anymore, I'm gonna add no more. I'm Silver. I guess you could try here, for now at least. All right, Silver. Uh, you've met Silver, he seems arrogant. I hope he will be able to teach you something. I hope so too. Uh, I think Mick told you about our rookie league. You're welcome to participate. Take fifth place in the league? Low expectations. It's like, don't even place. Don't even podium in the league. Fifth. How many people are competing? Five? I hope so. Uh, it looks like you want to know how to fight. I do, because, um, here's the thing. I had a terrible street fight that then some guy came along after I lost brutally and said, hey, you look like you know how to fight, which makes me think, I don't think Mick knows how to fight. Uh, sure, why not? No thanks, I'm not in a fight mood right now. No, uh, you are in a fighting mood because you're just wearing fighting shorts. Balanced tactic, default tactic without any evident strengths or weaknesses. Oh, you can pick tactics, right. Okay, so this is just gonna make me kick and defend about the same amount of time. This guy has way more stuff though. Okay, so I just don't click anything. Just let it all happen. No, no. Nick, resist your temptation to play the game. All right, that was round one. Can I take some of your skills away? No. I'm sure I've got nothing else? Correct. Fight. Why does he keep getting more energy than I do? I guess, technically, I just need to survive a round, right? I just need to survive the third round. I've seen Creed. It's all about just getting there. Minor spoilers for Creed. You know, for a game called Punch Club, not really punching that much. I lose. Wait, what? Oh, I guess, technically, I lost on points? Yeah, I've seen Creed. Minus spoilers for Creed. So I get minus four health, but plus five happiness because I'm fine with losing. Not bad, but you're out of shape. Oh, I do not look it. Uh, you can train in my gym, not for free of course, but since you know Mick, I'll give you a discount. Awesome. You need to reach level five in one of your parameters too easy. You have a possibility to sign up for a league fight. It is indicated by a yellow exclamation point. Moint? Point. Yellow ex <laughs> Yellow exclamation point. Do I want to sign up for a league right now? Or do I want to continue just fighting? I guess, no. I want to, I want to follow the exclamation points. Pay the entry fee, 10 bucks, yes, because I want to train up. I want to hit level five in one of my parameters and then join a league. Pay the entry fee, you betcha. Oh yeah, I am out of shape compared to these people. Look at this guy. Well, I'm definitely going to hit the tire with the hammer. That seems like the best use of my time. So this game is way more like a, um, this sounds derogatory, it's more like a mobile game. Like, the, a lot of the game is playing itself right now. It's an idle game, that's what I'm trying to say. Like cookie clicker. Is this how easy it is to actually become fit? It is? Mm. Mm. Is that how you got to where you are today? Yeah. This is gonna take forever to get to level five. Maybe I just need to focus on one. Or just focus on one. Just focus on these tricky feet of mine. Okay, so... I need to leave to get food from Mick, but then am I gonna need to pay another 10 bucks to get into the gym? I gotta go by foot. I'm gonna get in a fight. Oh no, I'm not, I'm fine. Uh, Mick, feed me, buddy. Ask about food. Do you have any? Here is your meal. Uh, maybe? Really? Cause I'm only half full. Oh no. I have to pay 10 bucks every time I get in? I really need some sort of membership system. Okay, I have gym equipment at home. I am going home. I've got tires at home I can hit with hammers. Uh, let's go in there. I can just work out all day here. Yeah, I can just do push-ups forever. 
Yeah, this is great. This is way better than the gym. Why go to a gym? Look how much more stuff I'm getting. I'm getting everything from a push-up. Whereas before, you know, running on the treadmill is not necessarily giving me strength. Uh, he's sobbing. Uh, he's reliving memories of his past. Or maybe he's just tired. He's sad because he doesn't have a t-shirt. Okay, go to sleep. Do I have a job? I can't... I was on my way to a job when I got in a fight. Gym, grocery store, mix office, work. Spend time in health to earn some money. I definitely need some money. That's okay, boss. I'll be there in three hours. Because I choose to walk around the park. Every time you finish your job, you get 50 bones. Damn. You can't work anymore because you're too tired or hungry. Where's my money? <laughs> Where is my money? That's okay. I was too tired to work anymore. Let's just walk six kilometers home. Healthy breakfast soda, nothing. Um, is there a cat I can eat? I know, there's nothing I can do for you. Well, I could go to Mix. He'll give me food. Feed me, old man. <laughs> oh, thank God! <laughs> Why do you all sleep on the couches? Why do none of you have proper homes? Look at all the shit you have here that you could sell to buy a bed. Where's my money? Here we go. I thought that was just filling up each time. Okay, cool. Every time you finish your job, you get 50 bucks. Here we go. 50 bones, 50 big ones. I could actually probably get a second 50 bucks right now. I'm just gonna stay overnight at work because I'll just sleep on the hard ground because I don't have a bed anyway. There we go, finished my job. I'm hungry, I'm tired. And you know what? I can afford a bus home. Rookie league, sign up starts today. Oh no, should I sign up for that rookie league? I guess I probably should. Does that mean I need to start fighting? It's the last day for signups. I have to do it. Next fight in two days. Oh, crap. Oh, I'm going to be fighting Songmo or Bob Dredson. Lenny Moskovitz, Gordon, Kick Sloan, Mr. Krakus, Salvador Punches. Oh, I guess I should cheer you up because you got the little sad face. We'll go watch some TV in a second. That'll make you happy. It's like having a kid. You're just trying to make your kid do a bunch of push-ups to get ready for the big fight. And they're like, ah, I just want to watch TV. I'm not happy. Like, shut up. Sleep. Eat. Here we go. The fight is today. Sure, I'm ready. <laughs> Have I learned anything? No. But Songmo, oh, he's only one in strength, one in agility, and one in stamina. I'm a 2-2-3. Two, two, and he's got punch and block. What have I got? I got kick and dodge. Let's do it. And he's not even balanced. You suck, Songmo. Oh, I've so won this. I'm destroying already. Grab him by his ponytail. Rip it out. That's an irresponsible thing to have in the ring. This is terrific. I'm destroying Songmo. Destroying Songmo! I'm beginning to think maybe I overleveled myself. I thought I had to get to five in an attribute in order to be like an efficient fighter. This is just, this is murder. This is unfair. This is Muhammad Ali beating up Pete. No one wants to watch this. Oh, Songmo, I'm so sorry, but you have such a delicate name for a fighter. Not like me, Nick Boy. I reckon two more kicks will do it. Boom! You have enough skill points to unlock a new skill or perk. It is indicated by the yellow exclamation point. We'll see what I have leveled up. Oh, wow, this is a huge skill tree. Way of the turtle. <laughs> Suicidal attack, headbutt. <laughs> I want to fight like a turtle. Uh, let's unlock... Punch. Feels like a good thing to unlock in the game called Punch Club. And where did I get... I'll sign up for the Rookie League. Next fight's in two days, number 11. We're gonna leave it there. Punch Club is not the game I was expecting it to be. That's not necessarily a bad thing. I was just expecting it to be much more of a sort of actual fight game where you select the moves that you do. Whereas this is a life simulator game. This is a real time sort of strategy management thing. Uh, I enjoyed it once I understood what was actually happening. Here's a tip. If you're worried about like who you're gonna fight next, maybe go to leagues and you can click on the people who you can fight, and it will show you what attributes they have. So if I had clicked on Songmo, I would have seen he's only the 111, and I was completely over-leveled for him. I can probably take on the next guy as well. 
um, almost immediately without training up too much more. But uh, obviously here I'm trying to level up, get through that league to get to the top, and then I, I assume I graduate from a rookie league to a semi-pro or a pro or whatever, whatever. Uh, hopefully working my way through different gyms and, and places as well. And also, there's much more RPG elements in the game as you continue going. Like, you can get a girlfriend and, and do stuff like that, which I imagine means that you start balancing all those things. So spending time with your girlfriend, you know, makes you happy. And then that ups your happiness. And then winning fights has obviously made me incredibly happy because I'm I'm thrilled at the moment that I punched out Song Mo. Uh, I, I actually enjoy these kinds of games. I enjoy the sort of, like... Uh, figuring out what I want to focus on and uh, prioritizing certain things and, and working towards something rather than, you know, just punching people in the face. I also love the art style of this. It's, it's incredibly detailed. It's really beautiful looking. A lot of care has gone into it. I'm really hoping that as you continue through the game, you, be, you go to more and more places, like you go to better gyms and eventually, I assume, fight in stadiums and that sort of thing. Uh, but yeah, this is, this is a fun little management game that seems like something good that you can play while watching TV or something because it doesn't involve too much actual concentration all the time. All right, that's it for today's episode. My Pocketeers! Nick Boyer. Can I punch silver?